Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to mod an app in my point of view. In this video, I'm explain every steps, why I'm doing that, actually what I'm doing while I'm mod. So this video will little bit long. Watch full video to learn new things. Let's get started. Open the app and note every detail. Check what happened when you click, note alerts, layout style. I notice one splash screen, then disclaimer alert. If click VIP, you redirect into subscription activity. Also, if you click any video, you can redirect into subscription panel. I just go to setting, then click my subscription. It's also pop-up subscription panel. Okay, now start moding. If you download app from Play Store, it's installed in split APK type. You need to convert simple APK, then start moding. I use anti-split M to make split APK into simple. Simply select the APK from installed list, then choose path hit OK. Now open MT Manager, locate the APK, we already make it simple. Now we need to kill sign, no need for all apps, but it's prevent from app crash. After kill, just install our app and uninstall original app. Okay, now what we do? View APK, then choose DEXs, then search for his VIP, then enter patch. It's that regular one? Actually, we are not a programming robots. Actually, we need a lot of experience. So let's check it out. How to really start mod for the basics. Now close the DEXs, start activity recorder in MT Manager, then open our targeted app. Note all activity. Once we open activity recorder log every activity, initially I get three activity, but I focused on main activity. I open every tabs to understand the flow of the code. After activity log, close the app, go to MT Manager, then analyze the activity. These are the important. We redirect before we cross two activities, but finally we are land in main. So we focus on main, click to copy the text. Now go to Dex's search with class. Paste it and search type with class, then open main activity class. Now we are in the right place, but how we start? Where we look for the first. Usually I check fields first, but in this all, all fields are obfuscated. So hard to find the right value. So in this case, we need to use navigation. Simply use switch option to analyze the total strings of this main activity class. Read every strings carefully. If we found anything suspicious, then we go for it. Note one more thing. In moding process, we sold try to read the code in reverse. Like if you found anything, just check the upper code lines. I found this two strings are related to VIP. I choose to check this. Check the invoke static of A. If you go to A, as you can see, there is the is VIP sting. It means that static value of A. Verify the VIP status. Let's check method A. Usages, then we decide. Now you can see, it's used splash activity. It means it's checked while you open the app, you are a VIP or not. Also it's used in main activity, subscription activity. So it means it's a valid one to modify. So how you mod? Let's check the method of A. This method get value from preference B. It means if B set as VIP is positive, then A value also changed into positive. So let's check B inputs. This preference used in many places, but we found only one put value. Most of the us thinks 
If we change that one value, it can make VIP. Let's see. Simply change move result P1 into true, make VIP in all places. But this is completely wrong move because there is no Boolean value found in the method. So what we do next, we found Boolean value in the method of A. So go back to the A. Now we can see Boolean Z in this method, so we can enter our patch here. Simply save and compile the APK, the install it, and check our mod result. Now open the app. As you can see, there is two new alert will visible. We can remove it at the end. Now we can check our subscription details. Now check this, you activated lifetime subscription. Then we are going to remove these two pop-ups. Open main activity again, then search for show. Every alert should used show option to initiate the pop-up. There are four results. We check one by one. Analyze the code. I found edit text in one method. It means WhatsApp pop-up. It allow you to type your number using edit text option. I decided to hide the alert. Now check the other one. I found download the app string in main activity. I found same string in one method, so I decided to hide it. Save and compile the APK, install it, and check the results. Now there is no pop-up visible. I covered all details, how to mod an app in perfect way. This app available in my Telegram channel. I hope you understanding the process. Don't forget to check my previous videos. Hit like. Don't forget to subscribe. It's encouraged me so much. Have any doubt feel free to ask. Thanks for watching.